wouldn't want to record videos that look like this or this or this. Today, I'm going to show you how to install the Gorilla Tag camera mod that all of your favorite YouTubers are using. Chubby or snail. Ooh. Ah, he has a face. We should edit a Gorilla Tag monkey over me so that you could hide the, the ugliness. But I'm on a computer so I can show you how to download the camera mod for the game. First things first, we have to download the monkey mod manager. So I've included a link in the description, but I want to warn you, like, you guys really shouldn't be trusting random YouTubers to give you links to download. It could be viruses, it could be malware, like, really, you should not be trusting me. Fortunately, I'm a pretty large person in the VR space, so maybe that makes you feel more comfortable. But the better solution is you should join the Gorilla Tag modding group. This is a server with over 250,000 members. I've included an invite link in the description. So, for example, if you want the most up-to-date version of the monkey mod manager, you just go in here and type question mark MMM and the top result will be the most up-to-date link. So we can click into this together, visit the site, and this is what it's going to look like. We're currently on version 1.3.1. It might be newer when you download it, but this is what's currently available. And you just go down to here to monkeymodmanager.exe and click into it. Once it downloads, be sure to click into it and be sure to open it up. So this is what it looks like. And my understanding of the monkey mod manager is that it's a tool that helps you set up the proper folder structure on your computer so that you can just plug mods in. Once we have this open we want to scroll down a little bit the only thing we really need right now is this thing called computer interface and once you click it it's going to automatically click these three items which is expected then hit the install update button and you're good to go feel free to exit out of this now that we're done and now that we've downloaded this the next thing we want is to install the yizzy camera mod i've included a link to the yizzy camera in the description but again if we're going to rely on the trusty gorilla tag modding server go to the pc mod releases channel and then scroll up until we see something that says yizzy camera it might take a little bit but there should be a pretty up-to-date version in the near future and here we go yizzy cam mod v2 1.0.8 is the most recent version as the making of this video it might be newer when you do it we're gonna see a very similar website and the important part of this is that we download the dll file that is the exact format we need and now we're gonna move it to our gorilla tags plugin folder click here we'll go to our c drive we're gonna click into program files x86 we're gonna go to something called steam wherever that is starts with s we're gonna go to the steam apps folder we're gonna go to this funny game called gorilla tag and then we're gonna go to this bep inex folder now if you don't see this bep INEX folder, it means that you messed up on the monkey mod manager step. Either you didn't download it properly, or you didn't go down here to click on the computer interface step, or you didn't do the install update. It's one of those things. Make sure you do that, and that will make sure that the folder shows up. We're clicking into BEP INEX, and then we're going to plugin. And this is the final destination where we're going to take our Yeezy Cam mod and just drop it into. And once it's there, you're all set. That's the hard part. These next steps are going to show you what it looks like in the game and how to operate it, so stay tuned. So when you spawn in, this is what you should see. This is the Yeezy camera right here. And if we take a trip over to it, We'll see a few things. Number one, you can just grab it. This shows you what the camera is recording. If you hit the flip button in the corner, then all of a sudden you'll be able to see yourself, which is awesome. This is the cool footage that I was showing you at the beginning of the video. But also, there's a few other settings you can play around with. So one thing you can do is just grab the camera like this, and all of a sudden, boom, you have footage, which looks awesome when you're just jumping around. Boing, boing, boing. A little hard for me to jump around with one hand because I'm bad at the game. But if you're good at the game, you can get some really sick angles like this. Another cool button you can hit is the follow player button. And look at this. I'm not holding it anymore. So look at this. I'm just bouncing. I'm bouncing, moving, not even looking at the camera. And it follows you anywhere, no matter how bad you are like me, where I'm just falling everywhere. Now, it's important to note that these mods work pretty good. But every time Gorilla Tag updates their game, there's a chance that the mod will stop working. And they have to come up with a new update. So that's another reason why you should join the official modding server. Because they'll always have the most up-to-date version. But also, even if you have the most up-to-date version, it still might be slightly broken. So for example, when I joined the game with this mod, I know that the computer just completely disappeared. I can no longer type anything onto it, and it was really stressful. The solution was to go back to the plugins folder on my computer, go to the computer interface folder that spawned, and just delete it. And doing so brought the computer back to my game. It's kind of funky how it works like that, and I honestly don't know why it worked. If you're a real Gorilla Tag fan, you've surely heard of Bothaya, who's one of the very few people in the Finger Painter program. Well, he also plays Rec Room, and I challenged him to the ultimate quest contest, so be sure to check out this video right here because it's really intense. Thank you all for watching, and remember, stay chubby.